Okay, here's how we're going to sync our uh, Gmail and iOS contacts together. Basically what this will mean is any contact that you enter inside of your phone will automatically show up in your Gmail uh, and vice versa. So let me just show you on my phone right now. I'm going to click on contacts just to show you that I have no contacts in there. Now you're going to have some in there because your iCloud account is probably um, already set up and please make sure that you keep it that way but I've just removed it so that I remove all contacts just so that you're able to see um, what's happening as we go along. So first thing we're going to do is head back into our Gmail. We've imported this list as I showed you in the first video but I just want to make sure that we double check that you are also adding all of these names into your regular contacts. You can see my contacts right here. It doesn't. If I click on it, it doesn't have any because by default when you bring in and import a new list it doesn't automatically add you. And when you sync across you want to make sure that those contacts are part of just your regular contact list. So it's really easy. You just click right here and choose all that just selects all the people in this list. Up here at the top where it says groups you're just going to choose my contacts. They've been added. You see a number right there that says 70. Okay. So now what I can do is head over to my phone and I'm going to go under my settings and I'm going to choose, so this is just scrolling from the top down, mail, contacts, and calendars and I'm going to add an account. Okay, I'm going to choose Google and for demonstration purposes I'm going to use the EdTech account because my personal account has got something like 6,000 contacts in it so you don't want to see that. So you just put in your credentials hit sign in and you're going to be prompted uh, with a little message saying do you give uh, Gmail permission to access your stuff click allow okay and now here's the important part I'm going to turn off mail and turn off calendars and make sure that my contacts are selected if you're using um, um, any of Google services, Google app services on your iOS device, I really recommend that you actually download the app. So download the Gmail app rather than syncing your mail with the um, native um, iPhone app, okay? Same thing with calendars as a brand new Google calendars app. They're both free. So I'm just gonna hit save. Okay, and now I'm just gonna scroll down a little bit. So right here where it says contacts, you're gonna have you're going to have an extra um, value here, okay? Which I don't have listed here because I didn't have um, my iCloud set up. So underneath my info, it's going to say so, like right here, it's going to say default account, and you're going to click on that and make sure that it's set to Gmail. And all that means is that all of your brand new um, contacts that you create in your phone are automatically going to get synced to Gmail. Okay? Don't worry, you're not going to lose any of the contacts you already have. So now I'm just going to go back into my contacts and you can see just like that it's already synced them all. Now if I open them up and I showed this in a previous video I'll use Kurt again. If I open that up it's going to tell me where Kurt, the school that Kurt is at and what his um, role at that school is also. Okay, So just to quickly show you the power of the sync, I'm just going to come back over here and click on my contacts. So let's create a new contact from my on my phone. We'll just call this Bart Simpson. Okay, and I'm not even going to add anything. I'll just click done. Okay, and you can see that it kind of like pushed down there really quickly. And look at that in my Gmail, Bart Simpson shows up. And let me just do it from the opposite side. So now let's do Lisa Simpson. Okay, and we'll give her an email of lisa.simpson at rdpsd.ab.ca. Didn't spell it right, but doesn't matter. If I head back over to my phone, scroll down to the Simpsons. There it is, Lisa Simpson. So your phone and your Gmail contacts are completely synced and ready to go. If you have any questions, don't hesitate.